Good morning, this is Margaret Petty, the University of Sewing and it's Facebook Live, and I have my trusty Yay. friend here, Denise. Yay. And Denise works with us at the University of Sewing, if you didn't know that. She's been not with us for a couple of weeks, isn't it too now? No, it, it was just Monday, but it feels like I've been gone for like a month. Oh, but for Fridays. Yes. No, you're right, I didn't make it last week. No, bus, you didn't. School bus children issues. Yeah. So you haven't been here for a couple of weeks. Yes, That's I've what I was talking about. I knew yes. you'd been in the shop. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I, it's been a couple days, Margaret, but not a couple weeks. So, yeah, so yeah, we, yeah. We've been off on a real roll this morning. Oh my goodness. Facebook just changed everything again. Yes. <laughs> yes. So it took us a minute to get online. Sorry about that. Um, but, you know, we've got so many fun things that have happened this week. I can't wait to tell you about everything. What did I tell you today was the he, National the, Have Fun at Work Day. <laughs> so that's our plan, and, and you should come and join us. Yes, and yes. so you will have fun coming in if you do. It's sunny now in Bloomington. It it's nice. supposed to go up yes. to 40 degrees. I am yes. very hopeful all the snow will melt away, <laughs> and mostly because the ice. The ice is the tricky it's part. The sure. ice is the tricky yes. part, so be careful if you go out this morning because it's a little challenging. For um, sure. But hopefully by midday today, we'll see some of this go away. That I'll would be, be nice. really pleased. That would be all right. I yeah. think we'd be okay We didn't get nearly the snow that they claimed we were going to. And I yeah. told you, as soon as they like shut down all the schools and everything, <laughs> we would never get all the snow they claimed. No, even the children were disappointed because it wasn't good sledding snow. They made a fantastic snowman. Yeah, it was good for right. snowmen. I mean, and we saw some of our employees make a, their kids make a couple yes, of them. Because yes. Lacey brought pictures. Oh, cute. Her daughter made a little baby oh, snowman. Yeah. No, the one that my kids made, I think, was about. Well, this they tall. did one that was five foot, and then they did one that was only um, like here. It, it, it was so cute, and and she named her and everything. So it was pretty. Ours funny. was named Peter. I think. <laughs> I love that. Okay, so if you're smart and live someplace warm, right? Yes, hi mom. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> so. We've got some really cool machines here to show off because... Hey, before you get started, though, oh, say oh. hello to all your friends. You've got the gang watching this morning. Oh, <laughs> the usual suspects. So, yep. Debbie and Elaine and probably Kathy. Yep. And, yes, many, yep. many Maybe more. Maybe Donna. Donna. Yes, yep. Donna. Okay, yes. and... And half the gang has already shared, oh, so... Oh, you guys are the best. Okay, so we have to talk about the sharing. We do, which and, means and, I have to and I don't think you have been here since Whitney became our ambassador. No. And so Whitney Luckenbill, who has the YouTube channel called Tomcat Stitchery. Very cool channel. It is really cool. Yeah. Now, Whitney only has 30,000 viewers. <laughs> She we is. are we're we're up to almost three. I'm really like pleased. We'll but get there, Margaret. We we'll will. We will, and and probably in thanks to her too. I'm sure. It will so help. um, we've got some really cool stuff for the folks of you who love sewing machines like we do to tell you about today. And you know we do the Bernina stuff, but let's talk about the sharing. Go get go Let get it. Get go get it. We have a really here. cute little share today. I love this. Okay. So tell people what we're gonna, what they can potentially win. So this was from, and you know, guys, if we get over twenty shares, we might start doing two prizes. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> I like that. Look at this. This is a Riley Blake. It's a fun panel, and it's from She Who Sews. Yes, which was a fantastic so all one. of us do. So this is wonderful. Stitch in time for two thousand and twenty-four. These are your basically your tea towels. They are, and your two thousand twenty-three. This is says um, French and American fabric hangings. That's kind of cute. And then there is the one from 2022, which we just put in the box. And that is Household Stitching Machine, which is so cute. So what are you suggesting people use this for, Denise? So, you know, if you're looking at this thinking 2022, well, that's old news. You know, I, I don't need, what would I do with a calendar? Cut it off. Cut this part that's off. That's what I was going to say, is just cut yes. this part off and use that. You've got this fantastic little mini panel, kind of. You could do a really cool wall hanging. You could do a pillow for your sewing room. You know, and that's true of all of them. If the, yes. the You know, you could take and cut those off. And if you want 23 hanging up in your room, that's great. But sure. if you don't, it's yeah. not a big you know, deal. But do. these could be really cool uh, panels to put on a lot of things. I'm thinking it would be fun on the back of like a jean jacket. 
Oh, that would Wouldn't be that really be cute. Yeah, that'd be yeah. really cute. It'd be simple. Yes, You know, absolutely. a little bit of fusible behind it, and you turn under the corners if you want, or you could to take and do a applique stitch of some kind. Oh, yeah. And it could be really simple, but it, it's like it would make it your own, and you would have something fun. You could quilt around the designs to give it a little bit of texture. Yes, so this is a really cool idea. This is a really cool idea. Okay, so the deal is when we share, please share, what you have to do is Facebook, because of our privacy settings, doesn't let us know who the specific people are who shared. Um, I will tell you, we've had an interesting thing or two <laughs> happen. Recently, we've had people say they shared, but we don't think they actually did. Because Facebook's really clear about telling us how many people share. Not so, necessarily who, but how many. They no, give they us a tell number. us how many. Yeah. But what happened, like, in, we've had this happen a couple of times, mm -hmm. is we've had people say they've shared, and we've ended up with, like, maybe 12 of them. But the actual shares, according to Facebook, were only, like, eight. Yes. yes. So I think it's just an issue where people maybe don't understand understand how to do this so let's go over it for a second because all you have to do is go onto Facebook and when you're watching this there is a button down on the bottom right hand side of your screen that will say share and what it will do is it will put it into your feed the other thing you can do is share it with specific people. That's fun. I like to and do that And so too. that will also give us a credit for sharing yes. but you have to do one of those two things so the other thing, Margaret, I think is sometimes they just get so excited. They say share, and then maybe they forget to share it because they're right. so excited sure. about the things sure. that we're this sharing is, with so, them. So we would really appreciate it if you actually hit the share button. Please hit the share button. <laughs> And you, would, uh, and you write it in the comments because we can't see who the people are. Yes. And so we would be really grateful if you do that. Okay, so we're going to set that aside for the minute. Yes. And then why do we have these sitting in front of us? Th this so. is um, sort of a, a story of opposites, don't you think? Well, it's definitely a story of beginnings and where we're at today. Some history. A There's history some, lesson. There is some history. So a lot of you may not realize it, but um, there was a point in time where we went from treadle machines that were manually treadled mm -hmm. to where we became, they became electric. Right. So when that happened, Singer sewing machines were the machine. They were, for sure. They were the biggest sewing manufacturer in the world, not just in the country, mm -hmm. but in the world. And so what happened with them is that they had these wonderful straight stitch machines. Look how cute they are. They're very pretty. And we have one sitting in front of us. It is a transition machine. Oh, I've never heard of that. Well, this machine was originally manufactured as a treadle. Gotcha. Then they turned it into an electric motor machine that was portable. Right. And beautiful case to go over top of it so that when you weren't using it, it would look very pretty in yes. your room. Yes. And it suddenly took up much less room. Oh, right. It became much more portable. They're still really heavy, but yes, they, they are, are portable, very heavy. Sure. We we know about heavy with Berninas. <laughs> but look at the bobbin that came with this one. I would have never guessed that was the bobbin. That, that looks is, like a toy of some it, sort. It is the bobbin. And what they did is the bobbin went right in here. And this is crazy because I'm, I'm going to see if I can't get it in here for everybody because it's really interesting. So I know I that it does. I would have never guessed that. Mark. I know that it does this. I'm trying to figure out. We need out. Aaron. We do need Aaron. Need I need, you know, what we'll do? We'll do. We will. As, oh, I, that's what it is. Ah, I figured it out. Yay. You know what? I love sewing machines. They're so cool. Gosh. So this just pulls out. It has a spring oh. load. So this is the original paint. Everything on it is original, um, including the electrical, which seems wow. to be in really good condition. Wow. So this, 
This is sewing. This, here's a sample of what it sews. <laughs> now, I will say, Erin didn't I think about this, but this stitch length is hugely long. <laughs> so, we might want to put another sample on here with a smaller stitch length. Um, but you know what? That tells you you can baste. Right. That tells you you can do a smaller stitch length. And But, you know, the fact of the matter is most of us we're probably not really going to use this sewing machine maybe somebody might but we're not really but this machine is just this wonderful transition from going from you know we've got a single stitch plate here it's set up and ready to go we put a brand new light in for you and so we have this Look at what the new machines have for a bobbin. That's a big difference from that. <laughs> well, a lot of you may not even own a machine. Some of you, you know, obviously who watch are our Bernina people. But if you own one of the um, like 325s or the 330 sure. or a 335 or a 215, mm -hmm. they have a regular CB bobbin, they which do. is a really smaller s silver bobbin. The traditional guess, one that everybody get, thinks Guess of. what this will hold. This will hold almost this entire spool. That's kind of amazing. It is really amazing. This holds 135 yards of fabric. And I will tell you, I know for a fact, because I wound one of these Coates and Clark spools on one of these, and I ended up seeing the bobbin, or I mean oh, the, the spool through yeah. that what was left. <sighs> wow. So it holds almost that many yards of, of thread. It's funny how things have really moved along here. We have this big, huge bobbin now compared to this little. little can you tiny. imagine how many times you had to fill this up to do anything? No, and then when you think about the clothes, maybe not in the 40s that they wore, but I mean, they there was a lot more volume to the things. Yeah, that look they at wore. where it goes in. This is so interesting. Oh but goodness. I can't. I'm just thinking. Oh my goodness! You know, they probably had to fill a bobbin every three minutes. Right, right. <laughs> Especially if they so fast like you do. Yes, yes, yes. They do. <laughs> But, you know, things have just moved along here, guys. And, you know, we even have now uh, these high-tech threads, things like Isocor and machines that now are a computer with an amazing amount of things that you can do just by the touch of a screen. And, you know, I want to remind everybody about this. If you didn't realize this about your machine, and it's so funny, I get people in our Black Bob and Mastery class. Those are fun. And it's so much fun to show off these machines to our new owners. One of the things they always forget is that if you hit the question mark and then you hit something on the screen, it'll tell you what's there. I love that feature. Well, you know, the thing about it is, is that we're now expected to know what every icon in the world means. Sure. We've got them on computers, we've right. got them on our long arm, we've got them on our sewing machine, we've got them on our serger. Well, it it starts to get to the point where you're like, okay, I know I know what this is, but I can't remember which one of it is. Right, yes, <laughs> so yes. It's just wonderful. So the 570 is just such an amazing machine. And it's set, it, it, the, it, when you look at this and then you look at this, it is something else. You know how your phone will pop up memories from so many right, years ago? Right, The one that popped up this morning for me was three years ago, and it was the picture that I took when I took my 570 home and laid out all the stuff. It was like, look, she's home, and I love <laughs> my 570. And the 570 is just such a nice size. It, it goes is. to retreats really well. Yes. And, you know, there is so much to be said for what you can get in a sewing machine these days. But I have a very special deal for you guys. For those of you who really enjoy the history of our sewing machines, you really love them. Dave has offered something really special today. Oh, I'm curious. So what we've got is this beautiful Singer sewing machine. And it is a 128-23 machine. That's the model. It comes with the gorgeous case. He has offered... And it was made in 1949. It was made in 1949. Oh, cool. Okay. So this was, this was really an interesting transition machine. Um, so we've got the book for it. We've got some extra 
it's the, these little tiny spindle bobbins. And we can even do a video to show you guys how to, to wind the bobbin if, yes. that's, a, if yes. that, that's a want. Um, but we can sell this to you for $250. And if you're interested in this and it doesn't matter where you live, we will pack it up really nicely and beautifully and send it off to you wherever you're at for free. Oh boy. And this is not it, this is not light. No, no it is heavy. It, it is, is heavy. heavy. But how nice that it could go to somebody who would love it. Yeah, it's a I little bit of history. It. Yeah, it's a bit of history. Yeah. Now, of course, we really like it if you're in town. Right. <laughs> sure. <laughs> and come and get it. It would be safer all the way around. But I'm pretty sure we can figure out some pretty safe ways with padding and so forth. And, you know, it doesn't have really any plastic delicate parts. So no, we should no, be able it's, to it's ship a it. little machine. And we can take the bulb out so that it doesn't get broke. Things like that. And, you know, so, Margaret, I'm thinking our, our panel here, the text print on it predates our machine. Yes, but it does. it's vintage, just like our machine. I know. So it's they really, really, go it's together, really I think. fun to see all this yes. stuff come together. But I also want to tell you about just one more thing. And before we leave these lovely machines, so keep in mind, if, if you're interested in this machine, it is for sale. Um, and, of course, this beautiful 570 is for sale. Tenor um, and love yes, and, and, yeah. and but I, I also just got in the latest Threads magazines in the shop. And this one has some really, really interesting things I think our quilters were like. One, there is an art quilter here. They do a story about her. There's some wonderful embroidery things in here and hand stitching. The Threads Magazine hand stitching photos are just perfect. Wow. You, everybody can figure out how to do those stitches from what they, they have in here. But you know what else they've got in here? They always do this on the back of their uh, magazines. They do a bit of history. And so since we're talking about history, it made me think about this. Do you know what you're looking at right here? This is beautiful. It is a gorgeous uniform that the TWA stewardesses used to wear. wear. Back when, when we dressed. When we flying. dressed for flying. Instead of wearing our yoga pants and pajama bottoms. So. And who knows what else sometimes. <laughs> and it's really offensive and, sometimes. And that's when you had like a proper meal that they served you when yes, you were flying. Yes, it's very too. interesting. Yes. These have welt pockets in them. Oh, how and pretty. And bound buttonholes. Wow. These suits were just amazing. And there's several pictures and a story about oh, it. Neat. So it's really cool along with what they say on the bottom here but it's really interesting and so i thought this one out of a lot of the ones we've had in the past might really interest a lot of people so before they're gone you know all you have <laughs> i think I she's love history of just I think, about anything i think so. she's going to be buying this one like this. <laughs> so we're going to have this available for sale if you're you know again not in the area don't worry about it you can just order it online like you do anything of else course. and so if you for some we have been finding a number of errors on our website i'm trying really hard to get them fixed if you see something if you'll just shoot me a quick email um sometimes people think something's a mistake and it's actually not that's fine too sure um but i'm trying really hard to like get our website up to that next level and so we've spent the last two weeks just doing a lot with it um we have a lot of brand new things in clearance oh, take boy. a look at that remember there's a special going on with clearance where you're going to get the original 40 percent off and then there's an extra 20 percent off We've gotten in a lot of new things like um, Creative Grid Rulers. Ooh. And I have got my first couple of samples for my idea with doing a monthly log cabin, uh, a monthly log cabin class where what we'll do is it will be online and available in person. Wonderful. Don't forget there's a ton of classes coming up. And I mean, really, and open sews. If you want to come in and just hang out with us and sew for the day, we love you guys. Come and visit oh, us. We'd like yeah. to see you. Um, I had a brand new customer come in. She is working contract for one of the local companies. She's only going to be here for three months. Oh. But she was so excited because she could come in for open oh. 
sewing, which by the way, I do, I think we do have an open sewing today. Oh, um, our class that was originally scheduled for today did not get the signups we hoped for, so we ended up rescheduling it for further down in the year mm -hmm. and we're going to talk about that more later closer to the class but what i did want to tell you is that um the open sews are open to everybody um come bring your machine if you don't have a machine but or, or excuse me i shouldn't say don't have a machine if you don't want to carry your machine for a variety of reasons and you already know how to use a bernina machine we do have some 325s and 335s we can loan you but i really only feel comfortable loaning those to people who already know how to use a sewing those sewing machines sure um but any Bernina owner can use those machines because they'll understand what it is. Because they can't spend a half a day trying to teach someone how sure. to use the machine. That's not what open sewing's for. No, but and then they wouldn't a, get to work on their project. That's if right. They were that's in that's machine, right. So. That's that. That's not going to work. Come to a mastery lesson if you want to learn how to use the machines. That will, and they're so inexpensive. Do you? And you don't have to own one. To you do that. Do, you don't. You yeah. don't have to own a Bernina sewing machine to go to the mastery lessons. What you can do is you can come here and you can learn all about them. And this will give you a good idea if that's the machine for you. It's really, really fun. It's a great okay. way to do it. Okay, let's head into the. Would other you room. show the ad that's in Threads? Oh, oh I forgot. Not okay. just yours, but. Oh. oh no no no! So we have two ads in Threads magazine, so that's pretty exciting. I'm excited to see. So these. okay, let's see. Such I should have marked it. It's right at the front, it. I believe. Ours is in the front? No, I'm talking about okay. the Bernina. Okay, we will show that too, but I wanted to show ours. <laughs> so, okay. So, look at this. In the Threads magazine, oh, our yes. L890 is in here. Yes. Now, I don't know if you guys remember, but I have a special deal, in-store deal going on on the, on the L890s. Mm -hmm. You can get a cabinet and a uh, the big book of surging. And you can get the trolley and the L890, and it's at a very special price. But you gotta call or come in to get that special price. Because I'm not machine. allowed to advertise it over, so it'll be yeah. So anyway, this machine it tells you what it all does, and it's really cool. So it is so and, much and, fun. But we have to find our ad, so we can show people we actually. Well, we have a little ad. In here, your favorite source for fashion fabric. Oh, yes, yes. So we're on there right at the bottom. Yep. It's in alphabetical order. Mm -hmm. And there is actually, if I'm not mistaken, I think there's one, there's two of us in Indiana. Oh, nice. Isn't that neat? That is neat. So I for thought a that national was magazine. Really neat. That's very yeah. cool. Yeah, I thought that was really cool. They've got some gorgeous, gorgeous embroidery stuff. They've got some beautiful, all kinds of clothing stuff, of course. Um, things with wool, things with lace, and I need to find our other ad. Oh and then a goodness. whole section on quilting, wow. which is wonderful. How to, to you can do some measurements and fit for a variety of things. And I thought our ad was further up in the front. No, it's towards the back. Is it towards the back? Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you for telling me that. Oh, and there's one about dyeing. And so that... You know what, Dave? We're going to have to have somebody find it because I can't find it. We should have marked Stay a page. Tuned. Stay yeah. tuned. It's taking too long and people are going to get bored with that. So I want them to come along. If you are interested, we have <laughs> demos on our Laura Star anytime you want. It's up here all the time. So I want to go back and I want to show everybody, Dave. Oh, yes. I want to show them. We've got this ready. This is all ready for you to see what you would get. You've got your cabinet, your big book of surging, and you have the traveling case. I mean, this is such a wonderful thing. If you're thinking about clothes, this is going to speed up the process oh my immensely. Goodness. Yes. yes. Yes, immensely. And you weren't really much of a clothing sewer, but how many things have you made now since you've gotten yours? It, it's bananas, guys. I look for patterns easy enough that I can do and go, oh, I could do that on the serger. Yes, yes, I'll take that one. I'm working on a little top for my 10-year-old at the moment, so cross your fingers and I'll let you know how it goes. But the machine is fantastic. My construction skills for garments, yeah, I'm still working on that. But 
no issues with the machine. I love it. It's really easy to use. Oh my so, goodness. Okay, we're gonna come back around and show off something here. Now, this is the wonderful lip table. <laughs> so we've got this wonderful table that goes up and down, and it's got little pieces that go on here and here. So, so it's so big, and it has a whole area that flips up in the back here. Mm -hmm. So the 790, the top of the line Bernina, which comes with an embroidery machine, it has everything you need, and guess what you get for free? Oh, for free. Did you say free? Free. It sounded like you said free. I did. Oh. A 5,000, no, five, excuse me, a $6,000 sewing machine. But this isn't just a sewing machine. It's actually a serger. Yes, yes. It's the computerized serger. It's the baby sister of the L890. But you know what? For just a little bit more, we can make this an 890. This can, you know, I wish that we were like Star Trek. Oh. And we could just switch them. <laughs> you know how they had those little things that yeah, we can just go, whoop, and the 890 sitting here in his place. It's just a tiny little bit more of money. And did you know that if you're probably within, I would say, 30 to 40 miles of here, I can have Dave take everything to you. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't He didn't offer that, but I'm telling well, you, I can, talk to I can make we sure can, that he we can, can talk get, him into it. we can get that to happen. And Margaret, if between these two machines, well, and especially this and the L890 with the cover stitch, there really isn't anything else you would need to accomplish any garment sewing. No, no. You, you can have do, everything you would need. have everything you need. Yeah. Um, and the thing about this wonderful deal is that you can get 48 months, same as cash. Love that. So over there on the clipboards, the 48 months, same as cash. Oh, oh you found it. Yay! Found. She found it. In Threads Magazine, here we are. We are on page 31. I will remember this now. So, page 31 is our wonderful little ad. So, we're in a national magazine, you guys. I'm Yay! so excited. Okay, so I'm so excited about that. But I'm going to tell everybody. This machine right here, this the, the, the two machines in an embroidery unit. You get that whole deal. And um, you know what? The payment is for 48 months? Guess what it is? I have no idea. Can, you, you never even thought about it? I never thought about it. No. It's under $300 a month. Oh my goodness. It's under $300 a month. Okay, so I'm adding up. How many trips to Starbucks would that be? That's, that's very doable. It's very, right? very doable. Wow. For most of us, that is something that is within the realm of possibilities. And... If you've got a machine at home that you've been using and you thought, well, maybe I want to go ahead and do this instead, mm -hmm. I don't care what the brand is. I don't care what the the machine is. We'll trade it in. We love trading. We do love trade-ins. And I want, I'm want. i not going to really get a chance to cover it today, guys, because it's obvious we are getting to that time of the morning. We are. That we are going to be opening. But what I do want you to know is that we have right now a we have two sergers that are current model sergers that yes. are trade-ins. Yes. We have a 435 from back in the 440 days. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have a 1090. Yes. We have a 750 all here used a ready to sell to you. Do we still have the 880? Oh, we do have the 880. We have an 880. We have an 880. Okay. We have an 880. So, we have deals going on on our Burnett's. Dave, you should take and do a real quick breeze through. I, I will. All the machines that have the big circles. See the big circles? These are all also on sale. There is something in your price point, guys. There is something that you will love to use that you will feel comfortable with. If you're a mechanical person, the Burnett's are a great entry for you. If you are looking for the beginning levels of a nice embroidery machine, we have an entry level of Burnett 70. Guys, this comes with free software. It comes with the 
uh, Bernina. You said that word again. Which one? Free. 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 Yes, free. I heard yes. free. Free. Yes, it yeah. comes with the V9 Creator software. This is the Bernina software that that, that is a twelve hundred dollar free <laughs> part. Free guys. Yeah, it, it, this is this is twelve hundred dollars worth of free software. If you get the seventy nine, now you've got a sewing machine yes. with a lot of the same features you see on the Berninas. You have embroidery also with this. Mm -hmm. Twenty one ninety nine plus. Free software. Free. That's the software. I feel like that commercial where they go free, 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 free. Which one? Which one <laughs> I don't that? even know what it is. Yeah. But... <laughs> you know what? I, how good of the commercial can it be? Yeah. No, you guys, I, <laughs> I can't wait till tomorrow because we have so many beautiful things that came in this week. It's I'm not even gonna be able to show them all to you. <laughs> so did you notice that there was a cabinet covered? In, when we were doing our, our first part of this video. The mysterious red curtain. The red curtain. Yes. We have some really mysterious red fabric in there yes. that you can only see online. Go to our latest arrivals and check out the tildes. So they are so gorgeous. The, the problem with looking at them online is you can't touch it. It is, in my opinion, the nicest cotton fabric we've got in the shop. It's kind of amazing, and you feel like, oh, cotton is cotton, but no. No, this no. feels like it would make a gorgeous blouse. Yes. It yes. looks like it would make a gorgeous dress. Yes. It will make gorgeous quilts, obviously. And I can't wait to start doing some stuff with Tilda. It's yes. so, so beautiful. It and it's all there for you to buy. I just cannot ship it until after February 1st. <laughs> Which will be here before we know So it. keep an eye on, on February 1st. I'm sure we'll do a quick live video because it's in the middle of the week. And I'm sure we will do an unveiling. So yes. keep an eye out for that. But tomorrow, don't miss it because... Um, like, Dave, you can just briefly, like, show them this wonderful piece on the table. I can't wait peek. to show sneak peek of some of the amazing fabrics we've got in here right now. So there is some amazing stuff. Um, hey, guys, I just want to point out to you real quick before we go. There is, um, on our website, if you've got the Barbie box, that's the box we put all of our stuff in. We get with our Bernina sewing machine. And you feel like you've got more feet that work for one of those little those little gray things that we slide into that Barbie box. Um, when I first got mine, which you can bring over here, Denise, I didn't realize I could buy the different the proper you can ones. Customize it. You can totally I'll custom it. You do that. Okay, so we're gonna open this up. We sell all, all the different feet things here. It's a rack. For there is a rack for your bobbins. Yeah, and see the ones that have these four crystals on it have to have a specific one. There's the rack that just holds the ones that don't have crystals on it. There's a rack for those of you who have four that that those 15-year-old ones um, with the rotary bobbins that have two crystals. Mm -hmm. I know which ones you need for what specifically like your bobbins, which ones you need for your feet. All you have to do is if you if you're not sure um, call me and oh. I'll, I'll tell you which one you want to order, but we've got them all. We do. So. And they're very reasonable if you want to grab a couple of them and make oh, this Oh, they are really reasonable. You I, think, I think they're under $5, yeah. most of yeah. them. So if you're not having the feet racks that you want for your, so that you can fit the feet you want in here, then let us know and we will make sure that you get the right ones. Um, but we also have your spool caps and your foam pads and all these things that we all often think, think that, you know, okay, I, I'm missing this. The cat ran off with that. <laughs> One of the grandchildren decided yes, to use yes, it yes. as a Frisbee, yes, um, yes. you know, so anything like that. So if there's little pieces and parts that you just are missing after having your machine for a year or two, don't forget, we do carry all that stuff, but sometimes you won't know what it's quite called. Um, sometimes I don't know what it's quite called. I, I sympathize with this. But we have all that stuff that we can sell you, and we are happy to do that. Um, you know the thing I lose all the time are my styluses oh, to touch the right. screen. I, I swear I lose those all the time. So we carry those. So, um, But there are things like they're specific for various machines, so you yes. have to know which one you have. 
Um, so make sure that you call me like with the model of your machine, if something like that, it, it's so helpful if you know what the model of your machine is. Do you know where to find the model of machine on, on, do, do you know where to find it? Dave, show them. It's always right here. <laughs> it should be pretty easy to find. It should be, unless it's an older machine. Sometimes they were a little bit, yeah, but it's right on the front of the right, machine. Right. So if you have any issues, you're trying to find something, you want something, um, we will help you. So everybody have a wonderful day and we will see you tomorrow for Facebook Live.